In this video, I am going to demonstrate two very simple and different experiments that differentiate between a boiled and a raw egg. The roots of physics behind the difference in the dynamics of the two eggs lie in the principle of mechanics or in the law of inertia. Let us first see the difference in dynamics of the two eggs. You see here two eggs. One of them is raw egg and the other is boiled. But at the moment I am not clarifying which one of them is boiled. Let me take one of the egg out of the pan and spin the other vertically to its axis as hard as I can and observe the rate at which the egg is spinning. Now let me observe the dynamics of the other under the same conditions. Okay, one obvious difference between the spinning of the two eggs you may have observed, the first one spins very slowly, the second one spins faster giving a hazy look to its edges. When I try to stop the first one with my finger, it begins to rotate again, whereas the second one stops immediately. Now let us explain the physics behind the difference in the spinning dynamics of the two eggs. The first one is a raw egg carrying liquid contents within its body. The thrust imparted by my finger to the hard outer shell is not immediately imparted to the liquid content inside. And its inertia works as a braking effect making it hard for the outer shell to rotate immediately in the beginning. In other words, the liquid part opposes the motion of the hard shell of the egg. On the other hand, the second one is a hard boiled egg and acts as a single solid entity and begins to rotate all together in response to the thrust my finger imparted to the shell. When I touch the eggs with my finger, the boiled one came to rest immediately altogether. Whereas in the case of raw egg, the outer shell came to rest and the liquid part was rotating due to its inertia and after stopping it, it exerted a force to rotate the outer shell alongside. Now let us see the difference in, in the dynamics of these two eggs in a more quantitative way. Wrap around a scotch tape strap along the axis of the two eggs and stick identical string in both of them exactly the way you see in the video. Hang each of them one by one vertically and give equal number of turns to the string. In this video, I am giving 12 turns to each of them. Let it go. This is the boiled one. Keep on counting the number of rotation in the reverse direction. It overshoots the 12 turns by giving some extra turn in the opposite direction. Being a solid entity, the boiled one accelerates quickly and has more overall inertia to overshoot the equilibrium position, thereby overturning the thread in the opposite direction. On the other hand, due to breaking inertia of the liquid material inside the raw one, it doesn't allow it to catch enough acceleration and therefore has overall very little inertia for overturning the thread beyond the equilibrium position in the opposite direction. Stay tuned with me, do subscribe to my channel and, and also click the bell icon in order not to miss any updates I am bringing to you in the channel.